Alright, hello everyone. I want to kind of run through the torch essentials I've uh, learned how to do. A very simple cleanup tool to be able to clean up debris or things that are screwing across your server. I don't recommend running this as I have it running it every second, probably every few hours, just to kind to allow for it because in a moment I'll show you how it really works. But if you edit collection right here, it will show you the commands that are running right now. The commands that are running are large grid, small grid, and static grid. Now this is the code you input, and anything in these brackets, it will automatically delete. Now that includes case sensitive, so it has to be with a capital S and a capital G. It will delete static grid. That goes for large grid and small grid. Now to show you how that works, I'll just type a little bit so you can see it scrolling since it's running every second. Anything with large grid, will automatically be deleted. There it goes. And anything that is small grid will be deleted when it cleans up. Wait for it. There it goes. Uh, let's take a grid and we'll show you it's not deleting any grids. We also got military mine layer over there that's not being automatically cleaned up by it. We come here take a look at here this is the name of the grid let's just name it Aries but let's put large grid into it if you notice it is I'm not putting case sensitive we let it go let the cleanup run there's the cleanup and if we come here but if we name it let's put those capitals where they belong it deletes it. See, if you notice, it was Aries Large Grid. It doesn't matter. As long as Large Grid is in the name somewhere, in that proper orientation, it will be deleted. So, basically, uh, let's say we split the ship in half. The ship, one section of the ship will keep the proper name. The other section of the ship will not. So, like, say, Space Combat, and the debris starts forming. Now, you got two sections. I don't know which section is going to be deleted, but one of these is going to be deleted. There it goes, the front section was deleted because it became the new large grid. So debris and things that are screwing across the server will automatically be cleaned up by doing a system like this. Um, there are other ways to do things like this if you want to be a little bit more harsh. You can do things along the lines of... You can change this to no type and then go beacon add that anything without a beacon will be deleted by the server I'm guessing that is broadcasting using a beacon and I'm guessing this has a beacon on it as well yeah it's got several beacons um, hmm, that's a quick way to do this let's grab Uh, it's fine. Just find all the beacons on this section. Turn on all the beacons. Uh, this grid obviously was is used to avoid this cleanup. So just putting beacons throughout the grid would allow for it not to be cleaned up. Even the and then there's two more beacons here, and then there's a distress beacon in the back. Now there are no block of beacon type on the grid, it will delete the grid on cleanup. Maybe. There it goes. Okay, sweet. It did clean it up. Just took it a second. So there you go. Uh, you can do specific block types. It'll clean up those blocks if it has that block on it with using the no type. Now, for example, I do not know how to make it so if it does have this block on it, it deletes it. I'm guessing just no type. Let's try no type. I've, I'm testing on the fly here. So type beacon. Oh, there goes that um, ship, I guess. All right, let's put down the Aries. So this should be named, and the only thing cleaning it up is the fact that it has beacons on it. So let's see if it cleans it up because of beacons.
doesn't look like it. Okay, interesting. So that was just, just one of the tests to see if that would work. Um, apparently there's not how that works. So just putting in no type though. Adding that. And if this were to have no beacons, it would be cleaned up automatically. Now that's that tool. It's You can update it as the server. Essentials is very nice. You can update it as it goes. Let's add a new collection. And just say, make the server say, hello. Oh, I did that wrong. So this is Essentials is very nice. I recommend it for all servers. Timed one add. There, server's yelling hello at us every second. Always fun. So it's very simple, nice cleanup tool. Um, I recommend using essentials on all servers. You can just do some nice stuff for it. But that's it. Have fun.